If you've ever had an idea for a business and weren't quite sure where to go with it, a monthly meeting in Hancock might be the place to start. Today I'm talking about Carrot Ranch, and it is a literary community online for writers. And we work with a specific literary art form. It's called Flash Fiction. It's 99 words, no more, no less. Charlie is one of two presenters who laid out her business plan and was greeted with suggestions and viewpoints from local business people. This is a place to present what I do, literary art. It's a little bit unusual, but I consider myself an authorpreneur. So I was hoping to make connections in the community to work on some of our projects. People had some ideas about how to talk to entrepreneurs about doing giving pitches. They like that, that constraint of the 99 words. She made some contacts today that she believes will help her in developing her products. So from here, I have a couple of people that I'm going to meet up with to talk more about some of the literary outreach that Carrot Ranch does and to see how we can get more anchored in the community. While Charlie's business promotes writings and publications, Lynn's new business is providing a shared office space to local business people. 101 Quincy is a shared working space for people with different ideas. Uh, you can be working at the same business, but you don't have to be. You can come in um, as a remote worker, as a freelancer, solopreneur, someone that's just looking for a shared space uh, with access to the basic uh, life needs, right? Wi-Fi, coffee, and a desk. After her presentation, Lynn received a suggestion that could open her business to a new type of client. A great suggestion um, was to figure out a way to outreach to travelers or people that might be visiting the Keweenaw for a shorter amount of time, uh, maybe a month or three months, letting them know that they have a space that they can come work to um, and they don't have to necessarily sit in a coffee shop with a latte machine in the background. Her business opens at the end of this month and we wish her the best of luck. Uh, we'll be opening on May 30th. We've got that launch party coming up. It'll be from 2 to 8 p.m. Stop by, we'll have snacks, uh, drinks, toasting the new space and uh, be showing everyone our, our creation. I'm Lee Snitz for ABC 10 and the CW5.